Hello everyone, I am on a roll with videos this evening. This is my third one. But since I just showed what all would fit in my fanny pack, I had to show what will fit in this little tiny purse that fits in my hand. <laughs> if I hold it back, you can see just how tiny that it is. The brand is Studio Bagley Mishka. I believe that's how you say it. It retailed for $99 and I got it on clearance for 16 at Marshalls. It is called Crossbody Dome with studs in the metallic blue. I don't have the strap in here with me, but there are no little loops here, and there are no D-rings on the ends, so it will have to hook to the handles. I really hate when that happens, but when I'm not shopping, I probably won't care just so I don't have to carry it. This is the front of the bag. It is quilted and it is studded. It is so super duper cute. This is the side width, so you know it's going to hold more than you think. It has a really nice smooth metal zipper on top, which I really like. This is the inside. I have it packed pretty tight. So the first thing I want to pull out is my keys. My little granddaughter got me a keychain that has my name on it, and I love it. I've had it ever since she gave it to me. Now, it has a little front pocket, which I don't have anything in that one. It's just a slip pocket, but I could probably stick my pack of gum in there. So I have gum. I have this little pouch that will hold my clippers and band-aids, tweezers, little things like that, little chapstick. Right now, I have this wallet in there, but I think I'm going to switch it out for my Patricia Nash card holder just because it is shorter. This one is a little bit long. It fits in there just fine, but to get it in there, I kind of have to work it in just from this end. I mean, not hard. I mean, it goes in there easy, but it would be much easier with my shorter card case, so I'm probably going to switch that. I have a case in there just to show you how easy my iPhone 12 mini goes inside. Perfect, that's why I wanted that phone. And so I just went ahead and ordered me a iPad. So through the day, if I wanna watch videos and things, I can watch it on there. I mean, I do still get on Facebook and um, watch videos and things on my phone, but I feel like it's just so much easier. Uh, I don't have to worry about wearing my glasses and things but I mainly wanted that phone for my mini bags. I took, I think, three with me just to make sure that they would fit, and they did. So, I mean, I wanted that phone just for that reason, because I do love my mini bags. I go from in spurts. I either, my normal everyday purse is gonna be medium size. That's what I usually carry. The tiny ones, this is still fitting everything that I need, and sometimes I get in the mood to carry a large purse. And when I do, I have to have an organizer and I have my stuff that I normally carry and sometimes I throw in more that I wouldn't normally carry. So you know what that means, the bag gets heavy. So I have this little notebook as well and this pen. And then there is a zip wall pocket and inside that pocket, I just have a small mirror. That's all I have in there. My larger mirror, it wouldn't zip with it. So this is the inside of the purse. So I can just start putting all my stuff back in here. And it just amazes me what all fits in a little tiny bag. And then here's my keys. So there we go. Oh, and my pen. I would put it on the bottom because I wouldn't want to lose it. So there's all my stuff in there once again. Is that not crazy what all a little tiny bag like this holds? And now that things are reopening, I think, I don't know if the movies are open yet, but this would be perfect. Or to go to dinner and you just don't want to carry a large bag. So anyway, my little tiny baby bag. Thanks for watching. Bye.